I'm Ella and I'm the Plants Meow. And today I'm gonna to be doing actually two unboxings, but I'm gonna be splitting it up and also two videos. So you're gonna be seeing the next one the following week, probably. <laughs> but this week we're only just gonna do one. <laughs> actually, the reason I got these two, I was originally just gonna order from one of these sellers and then I found the other seller and then I was like, well crap, his prices are great. So I really ordered from him and I'm actually really excited about that one. So I'm doing that one this week. Also, I will have an anti-haul video coming up within the next couple weeks. Not sure when I'll put it out, but the unboxing that I have for today, one of the plants that I sold paid for it entirely. So it was one plants for seven new plants. So you might be freaking out wondering which one I sold. It was, I'm not gonna tell you which one, you'll have to watch the anti-haul video, but there's reasons behind it. Sometimes you just aren't in love with a particular plant like you thought you would be. And really, honestly, if you could sell it and buy a bunch of ones that you think you will really love much more than that one, I, why wouldn't I do that? I wanna be surrounded with plants that I love, not that I look at and think, well, you're rare, but is that enough of a reason for me to keep you? So it's kind of like just something that I've realized as of late, just cause a plant, even though that used to entice me more to plant, it's rarity. Um, now there's just certain plants that they're not as attractive to me personally. To someone else, they're gonna be so fulfilling and so happy to get that plant. They're gonna be, <laughs> and whoever got that particular plant, I don't know if they're gonna watch this video, but congratulations to you. It is a wonderful plant. It's just one that the particular spot I had it in, I have another plant that I'm getting today that would go in that exact same spot and that I actually prefer over it. And <laughs> it's crazy how cheap some of these are. So not the cheapest, obviously. So this particular seller is from Thailand and the shipping with FIDO certification is $60. So it was actually probably the cheapest I've paid for overseas shipping, which is pretty nice. And it came here very fast. So he shipped it out on Saturday. It got here on Tuesday. <laughs> Unfortunately, I wasn't here to sign for the package. So today's Wednesday and it's now delivered. So it looks like he shipped them in a pretty cushy manner. So here's the box. It's actually fairly large. So the plants that I got, I'm not expecting to be fairly big. So I think a lot of this is probably just gonna be like just filler to protect the plants, which is great. <laughs> This is what the inside of the box looks like. So I'm just gonna start going through them. It's actually shipped in camo paper, which is kind of cute. <laughs> Okay, so the first one, as you may recognize, is a Circestus mirabilis. I think that's how it's pronounced. It's a little wrinkled, but honestly, with leaves like this, it's probably really hard to keep them from getting wrinkled. So <laughs> the reason I got this one is because every time I see it, I always think of Chris. So I feel like it's just a plant he would really like. So while I also really love this, <laughs> I'm excited. I like the idea of him having plants in the household. So I also have a reason to collect a bunch of plants because I'm like, they're not all mine, you know? <laughs> but yeah, this is a really pretty. This is one of the $60 ones. And they actually, I expected, I don't know why I always expect everyone to ship everything in sphagnum, but this is still like in its soil. So it's a bit dry. So I definitely want to get that potted up today. Really beautiful. It's actually a lot bigger than I anticipated as well. So when you actually message him about his plants, he'll send you a link to kind of an album and that'll be shared to your Google Photos. And you can really look through and see pictures of the stock plants and the prices that they are. So I thought that was really cool. I could just go through and kind of decide which plants I wanted. And I love that idea. It's so organized. And I'm all about that organization. I really am. 
<laughs> uh, up to the next one. I'm really excited. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's so big. Okay. Yes. So this is super cool. It came so much bigger than anticipated. So this is a philodendron moonlight and that is variegated. So this was actually only $30 and actually I'll put a little kind of screenshot right here of like around what this plant could sell on eBay for. So as you see, it can go much higher here in the US. So paying $30 for this and it's really big. It's a lot bigger than I thought it would be. It's really exciting to me and it's absolutely gorgeous. It's just, oh my God, it's so beautiful. So much more variegated than the stock photo which I'm glad he uses a plant, the kind of plant he does for a stock photo because when you get something like this in the mail, you're never disappointed. Your expectations can only go higher. So I think that is amazing. <laughs> oh my gosh. It even has a new leaf like coming in. Wow. And $30, like, come on. How could I not? All right, to the next one. So this is my philodendron snowdrift. So I got this one for $40. I'm gonna put a screenshot up of what NSC Tropicals typically sells this plant for. So you'll notice it grows in white like in this picture and then it turns into this like dusty green color. It's really pretty. I really like it. The soil on this one still feels a little moist, so I don't know what's going on there, which is good though. Like you want it to be like that. You don't want it to completely dry out. But <laughs> while I'm excited about all of these, these next two I'm really excited for and can't wait to show you. <laughs> now I am new to these particular plants, so I may not be able to tell the difference between these two right away, but I will try. And I would definitely correct myself down below if I don't get it right, because I've never seen these in person. I don't know which one is what. <laughs> they look a lot alike though. Wow, I didn't expect this lined ribbing on the bottom of these leaves, which is really cool. Just checking really quick before I bring it to my face. This is so much bigger than I thought. So this is, well, I think it is <laughs> between the two and I haven't opened the other one yet. So I feel like that will be more of a telltale sign but maybe not. So this is a philodendron adabapoense, and I love saying adabapoense. When I first ordered this, I kept saying it to Chris and he's just like, you're so good at that. I'm like, I know, adabapoense, adabapoense, adabapoense. Like, I don't know, I really like saying adabapoense. So this is just something that I hadn't come across that I've been looking to get. So I'm really excited about that. It's actually really interesting. If you look at the undersides, I didn't expect this, but it has these lines on it, which is really cool. And I don't know if I mentioned this, but it is $60. I think I did. <laughs> but it's a really nice, really beautiful plant. 
my philodendron at a babuense. Watch how I'm saying it wrong this whole time. That would be funny. That'd be me. All right, and this is my last plant. So this is actually a hybrid of Adipabuensi. That's why I wasn't sure if I would be getting it right. <laughs> Okay, I think this is the hybrid. Yeah, because it's looking kind of bilati, like. So this here is my Philodendron Bilati Adipopoensi hybrid. And this one was actually $30. <laughs> so actually when I saw that, that is what really drew me to the seller because I was like, wow, that price, like that's so good. I looked through his other plants. I found all these that I thought were really cool. And then I kind of, that's when I decided to do a little bit of an anti haul because <sighs> make some space and to be able to afford some more plants. I'm trying not to like overdo it too much, but I already have, so. But it's really cool because right away I could tell it looked more like a Bilati, but it has that backing that looks very much like an Adabapawensi with the little ridges. So that's pretty neat. It's really beautiful. So my two Adabapawensis size-wise, were significantly bigger than pictured, so that was really awesome. I thought I was gonna be getting these little baby plants, so <laughs> that was cool. I thought I was gonna be getting like these kind of leaves. Honestly, that's like what the picture is. <laughs> so I'm impressed I got this, <laughs> like, so that's really cool. If you wanna see the two next to each other, so you can tell the Adabapuensi is more elongated and thinner while the Adipapuensi Bilatai Hybrid is more Bilatai in its shape. Okay, so not long after my shipment in this video, I saw that he posted a Bilatai for sale. So the one he had posted was, the, I think, the smaller size, which was $30, and this was his larger size, which was $50. <laughs> so this is a really big Bilatai, and I'm really glad I found one like this because I wouldn't have wanted a smaller one of this one just because it's more common obviously than a variegated bilati and if i was going to have this one i did want it larger so i'm super excited about it it's really beautiful great plant i'm going to show you it actually has three leaves just absolutely stunning I'm super happy with it. I like it so much more in person. I've been really, really excited about <laughs> the Billetai's and Adabapoenses of the world recently. And those orange petioles are such a unique feature. I absolutely love it. And just look at that. Just so thick and so hardy. Absolutely beautiful. So I did purchase a few other plants just to kind of make it more worth my shipment. So he recently changed the price of the shipments to $90 because it was getting more expensive to ship plants because rates had gone up. So I picked two more, <laughs> both which I was actually really excited about as well. They weren't there when I had initially went to place my first order as well. So this guy is my Philodendron Gigantium and he is the variegated one. So if you've seen my house plant tour, you'd see and I have a much smaller version of this plant, but the price was so similar and this one was so much bigger that I really just wanted this one and I'll actually end up selling the smaller one at a later date. And it also has a new leaf coming on the way, just like the Billetai over here does. So just really happy, healthy plants. Absolutely fantastic. I'm so excited to just watch this one grow. Just absolutely stunning very very beautiful and this last one here is actually my philodendron varicosum melanochrysum hybrid <laughs> so i was super stoked to see this one this is one i was looking for and i really couldn't beat the price 
So these, the Gigantium and this one, were both $60. And I'm so, so happy to have this one. It's just absolutely stunning and it feels amazing. Just the sheen to the leaf. It's gorgeous. And I have a hard time, like, not touching this plant. <laughs> It's already been about a week that I have had these now, and they're just super happy and healthy, and I'm so happy with these plants. Just absolutely fantastic prices for these plants. I am super stoked to have just all of these in my collection. I can't even tell you <laughs> how happy I am with these, and I actually have been changing around my plant room quite a bit in terms of setup, so I'm having it... While it was always organized, I'm organizing it in a different way that's more organized, if that makes sense. <laughs> and I've actually removed the bed from that room and I've set up a whole new display. And I'm really excited to showcase that for you guys. I will be doing an updated house plant tour in November. I think it might be the second or third week of November. I have a few videos coming out. Next week is actually going to be my terrarium building video, but it's going to be my Halloween edition where I actually compete with my boyfriend, Christopher, and we're gonna be building our terrarium side by side. And hopefully that's a fun video to watch and I'm excited to put that out there. And I think after that week, I'm gonna be putting out my Ethereum care video, then either one more unboxing or my houseplant tour. So I'm so excited to show that to you guys and I really hope you enjoy this video and I really hope you enjoyed these three new plants. <laughs> I am super stoked to have them in my collection. In all, I'm so impressed with the size of these plants and the prices of these plants. So thank you so much for watching this video. I really hope you liked it. Please leave any feedback down below. I would really appreciate it and I would love to comment back on anything you had to say. And if you really like the content, please subscribe and hit the bell icon. I do post a video every Wednesday. Thank you so much for watching.